Hi, my name is Sunday. In this video, I'll be talking about the emergency income. Ready to the emergency. REN. R-O-E-N. That's a short abbreviation. So it's all about supporting the lower income family. The government have come up with this proposal or with this support to help those ones that when they gave out the first 600 euro for people who are under autonomy and other people, those people, those kind of people couldn't gain from it. And there are also some kind of group of people that are also receiving citizenship money. Why they are middle, why there are people in the middle that are not receiving anything. That's why the government have come up with this thing, with this support. So if you know you are under those kind of group of people that you have not benefited anything and you are not working, nothing is coming to you. So that's why government have come up with this uh, support to help everyone. And the amount of the money is ranging from 400 to 800 euro. 400 to 800 euros depends on the family. But first, before I go further, if you know you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, I encourage you to please do subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell. So whenever I upload any new videos, you will know. And also, if you have also subscribed, I encourage you to click the notification bell. So whenever I upload any new video, instantly you will get to know it. Now, let's go. Emergency income, REN, R-O-E-N, is a new form of income support to help citizens in difficulty who do not have access to other aids, aid such as the 600 euro benefits that government gave out, the 600 euro benefit aid, and also those ones that are having citizenship income. There are some people that are claiming citizenship income. Why there are people that are not claiming anything? So that's why government has come up with this support to help them. You see, it is an economic contribution that ranges from 400 to 800 euros. As I've said earlier, it's from 400 to 800 euros. But it depends or it varies according to the composition of the family. It depends on how many are you in the family. So that's how the range is going to be. So if you are one in the family, the money will also be, it depends on how the money is going to be. So if you are that kind, five or six or seven in the family, the money will also climb up, but it will not exceed 800 euro. So that's how it's going to be. It says, which varies according to the composition of the family. For example, it's also for those ones that are unemployed. Those people, especially for those ones that are unemployed, or those ones, even though they are employed, but they are having black contract, so they are still under un unemployed. So it is for majorly for those kind of people. So we are going to look at what are the things that you need to have before you must be able to request for it. It says for you to be able to request for it, for a family to be able to request for it, the applicant must have residence in Italy. That's number one. You must have residence in Italy. Then number two, the valor of family income in the month preceding the request for the benefit and in each month preceding the subsequent disbursement less than the amount of the benefit. Let me explain. It says, the amount of income, for instance, one person like a father or mother is working in the family. The amount of income that the person or that whoever is received that is working in that family brings into the house. If it exceeds or if it's, if it's greater than the amount they are going to give you in the emergency income, they will not be able to give it to you. You will not be able to apply for it. So if, for instance, you are working, you bring in 500 euro and you are having family of up to two or three, four in the family, meaning you can still be able to apply for this emergency income. So all he's just saying is that even if you are working, if the amount you are receiving exceeds the amount of the emergency income, you cannot be able to apply for this. The emergency income is from 400 to 800. So if you are receiving 900, you brought in 900 or you brought in 1000, meaning you will not be able to apply for it. But if you brought in 600, 700 or 200 or 500, you can be able to apply for it. So that's what he's saying in this place. So number three, let's look at number three. Say valor of movable properties in the family must be lower than 10,000 euro. That's a value of movable property, e.g. like car, and also the amount of money you have in your account. If you are having more than 10,000 euro in your account, meaning you cannot also apply for it. So if you are also having a car or so everything that is greater than 10,000 euro, you cannot also apply for it if your car, movable property is greater 
higher, let's say it's 11,000 euro, uh, uh, euro uh, car, 12,000 euro car, you cannot also apply for it. So that's what they are trying to say in this place. Then the last one, it says we must have value of, uh, that is an easy, your easy must be less than 15,000 euro. So if you are having easy that is less than 15,000 euro, you can also apply for it. If your easy is more than 15,000 euro, that might also disqualify. So that's it. That must also disqualify. So if, if you are not working, you are not even having zero at all. You are even having zero is there. It's your very good chance for you to also for you to apply. So I'm going to talk about one aspect that many people are confused about, and that many people will also be trying to be asking questions about is that of the citizenship income concerning those ones that are receiving citizenship income. So now it says even the earners of income of citizenship even those ones that are receiving now listen to me even those ones that are receiving citizenship income can still request for it those ones that are receiving citizenship income can still request for it now listen to why can still request for it say but only if the amount of the citizenship income is less than the rent or is less than the emergency income. Now, if the emergency income is up to 800 euro, let me explain. If it's up to 800 euro and your citizenship income, you are receiving 600 euro and maybe you are roughly five, five in the number or four in the number of your family. I wish you applied for this emergency income. Maybe you have, your money would have been 800 euro. So they will not have to calculate it if you are receiving 600 euro for your citizenship income then the rest that would have make it 800 they will not add it to it meaning it's just 200 euro that they will be giving to you to supplement your citizenship income so that's how it's going to work if you are still having or you are receiving citizenship income you can see apply for it but if your money is lower if your money is lower than the amount that is mentioned if you are four in a house or you are five in a house, if the money is, you are receiving is lower than 800 euro, you have a good chance to apply. But if you are just one and you are receiving up to about 700 or up to 800, probably you are not even allowed to, 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 to apply for it because you are receiving more than if we are to be only the emergency income, maybe you will not be able to receive up to that seven or 800 euro. So that's why if you are receiving your citizenship income, it depends on how many you have in your family that is going to determine whether they are going to later supplement, whether they are going to later add to it to complete it or not. So that's another good aspect of it. So it did not cancel any citizenship income people. So if you are receiving citizenship income, you still have a chance of applying. And this emergency income, when it's being accepted after you have applied, when it's being accepted, they are going to pay it twice. They are going to pay it for two months, for first month and another month. So if it's 800 euro, they are going to pay it 800 euro for one month and 800 euro in the other month. It's going to be for two months if they, are, if, they, if they accept the application. So that's how it's going to be. When the application is being accepted, it's going to... It's going to be for two months. So it's all over Italy, not just in one region, not the first one they did that some region we are receiving it, other region we are not receiving it, but this one is going to be all over Italy, in all the regions of Italy. So the next question that people might be asking now is where to apply or how to apply. So it is INS that is in charge of this program. So it's INS that is going to be paying everyone that applied. So it's going to be on IMS website online people can be applying online but the dates that are be fixed is going to be from june so they have not started applying now so it's going to be from june that the application is going to start even the form and the moment it's not yet ready so it's going to be from june that the application is going to start and it's going to be on him's website and also other offices like cga and other patronante offices so you can be able to visit them meet them those offices are better if you can't do it online so this one you can do it in any other offices like cga so it's going to be very easy in you doing it in other offices if you cannot be able to do it online so as i've said earlier this one is for all regions in italy 
is to support those ones that are living in difficulty, especially in this difficult situation. There are many others that are still working. There are many others that have received one benefit or the other, one bonus or the other from the government. But there are some kind of group of people that have not received anything. That's why the government have come up with this proposal or with this uh, kind of benefit to be able to help them solve any kind of problem they are still passing through. So it's for everybody, especially those ones that are not working. So you can still be able to apply. Try it hard. Just when the application starts from June, make sure you apply or make sure you try. Especially those ones that are still receiving citizenship income. You can still apply as I've said. So I'll be trying to come up with updates about this uh, topic as well as uh, time goes on. So thank you for watching. Please like comment and share to others as well and please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and click the notification bell so that whenever i upload any new videos or informations you will know thank you and god bless you bye